Hello guys, and welcome back to the next episode of more Fire Emblem, Blazing Blade. We are back here, and if you're seeing this before the Comment Builder episode, which you probably are, it means it's still not ready. If you're seeing it after, yay, I finally got it out. I'm only saying this now because, of course, I'm pre-recording this, I'm recording this right as I clicked the uh, start uploading on the last one to YouTube, and I'm quite excited. So in the last episode, we went and we actually got the Manny Caddy, the amazing sword for Lynn, and I think she's going to be amazing with it. So, back to the video. The secrets of her past revealed in, to two word, in the words of two knights of Lycia. Now, to meet her grandfather, Lynn heads west. To Lycia and to her destiny. A mountain range separates the Sakai Plains from Bern. There are many bandits lurking here, the cruelest of which are the Talaver. Talaver. They wreak havoc on both Sakai and Burn, and their savagery knows no bounds. On her tenth day away from the plains, Lynn witnesses their atrocities herself. Ooh, with a Pegasus Knight. Dun dun. Chapter 3 Band of Mercenaries. I remember this chapter, yes, I love it. This place, it's. The entire area is in ruins. Why doesn't their Marcus do anything to help? Talver Mountain is home to a gang of vicious, ruthless bandits. No Marcus holds power here. My village was near here, on the other side of the mountain. My people were... The Talaver bandits came at night. It took only one night. The survivors numbered less than ten, including me. They're soulless beasts. I will never forgive them. Never. Linda's. I am not running away. I will be back someday. I'll be stronger. I will break their swords beneath me like twigs beneath the stallion's hoof. I will avenge my people. I'll do everything in my power. When the time comes, bring me with you. Sane. Don't forget me either. Kent. Oh, you too for a... I... your... thank you. Wait right there, little lady. What are you gonna do? Apologize, huh? Uh, I, that is, I... Hey, she's quite a catch, eh, buddy? I bet the boss would give her a pretty... I guess, the, I bet the boss would give us a pretty penny for her. Yeah, she wrapped me up a bit, so I figured fa fair's fair. It's no more than she deserves. I, I... What are you gonna do with her flying mule? Don't you dare touch her! What? You just watch your mouth, girly. Do what you will with me, just... Let her go, please. I beg of you. Ha ha ha, silly twit. Pegasi can only be found in Ilya. They're rare, beasts worth more... They're rare beasts worth more than you by far. We can sell it for a mountain of gold. Let it go. Ha. No, you can't. Come on, let's move. What's this? Be on your guard, Lindas. There seems to be some sort of commotion over there. That... That's a Pegasus, could it be? Florina? Is that you, Florina? Ah, Lynn! Florina! What are you doing in a place such as this? Lynn! I is it really you? I... I... Come now, no crying. I'm sorry. You are acquaintances? She's my friend. This is Florina, a Pegasus knight in training from Elia. She's a little uncomfortable around men. Tell me, Florina. What happened here? Well, um, when I heard that you had left, I decided to follow you. Then I saw this village. I flew down to ask if they had news of you. I didn't see these two, and, well, did your Pegasus land on them? Well, I, a little. Aha, you heard her. She admits her fault. She stepped on my friend. Now she's got to pay. Did you apologize, Florina? Yes. I told them I was sorry many times over. They just wouldn't listen. Don't cry, it's alright. Lynn. Listen, she's obviously sorry. Can we just let this pass? You don't appear to be injured or anything. No chance. The girl goes with us by force if need be. Hey, come on, bo come on out now, boys. The men are fair game, but don't put a scratch on the girls. That's a lot. Fred, we've got to fight back. Lynn, I... You're a Pegasus Knight, aren't you? You can fight, can't you? Yes. 
Listen carefully, Fred. We're facing bandits. They're underlings, but we can't take them too lightly. Let's clear them out. Are you ready? The layout around here might make it difficult to fight. The same holds true for our foes, too. If we use these walls, just to the main show of victory. Lin, who's that? This is Fred. He's still an apprentice, but he's my tactician. Oh, I see. Uh, Fred, I'm pleased to meet you. The red roof bu buildings are villages. Villages are in danger of being attacked. If an enemy unit reaches a village before one of our units does, the village will be destroyed. As quickly as possible, visit the residents and give them warning. Only good can come out of it, so please. So, so let's visit them. Please select Lin. Uh, something about visiting a village. Do do do. Visit. Is anyone there? Leave us alone, you thugs. Go away, go away. We've got no more gold for you. No, wait, please. We're not bandits. We want to help the village. Please listen. Remain inside, everyone. I'll go see what's happening. Not bandits, huh? So who are you? My name is Lin. My colleagues and I are just traveling through here. We saw some bandits about. We're going to deal with them, but we need you to go and warn the villagers. Hey, wait. The name's Will. I'm a traveler of sorts, too. Listen, these villagers have been kind to me. Mind if I fight with you? Not at all. We need all the help we can get. Welcome aboard, Will. By visiting, a vi by visiting a village, we gained a new companion. Will is an archer. He uses a bow to fight. Bows can be fired at, at foes more than one space away. Obstacles won't affect your line of fire. Attacking enemies without moving next to them is called indirect combat. If the enemy has no weapons com capable of indirect combat, there is no fear of counterattack, and that's to our benefit. However, you cannot fire on adjacent spaces. If someone moves next to you and attacks, that's it. Units with bows are best suited to lend assistance from the rear. Let's try some indirect combat, shall we? Select Will. Hey, it's me, Will, remember? Why don't you issue, issue me a... Bleh. I'm like so out of breath. Something about attacking through the wall. Attack, iron bow, and boom. Yes. Will is amazing. He really is not his shit. Next is Flurina, a Pegasus Knight. As you might guess, Pegasus Knights have the ability to fly. They can move over almost any terrain type. This small wall would stop most units, but it poses no problem for a Pegasus Knight. Select Florina. I, I'm ready to fight. I'll follow your orders. And attack this person. He's down. Florina is going to be an amazing unit for the first while, but she is sadly going to be replaced. Knowing your units and their abilities, and knowing how to use them in battle is a shortcut to victory. To learn everything about a unit, plus... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just check quickly. Does anyone have any loot for us? Not that I can tell, but this is an armory. I think they're going to explain what an armory does. Iron Sword's going to attack this person like this. Oh, right, no fear of counterattack. And I was like, that's taking slump, but he's dead, and that's all that matters, because archers in this game are pretty crap. Uh, snipers, they're pre-promoted, are actually pretty decent, pretty good, but archers are pretty horrible. So I want Florina to go to the village to her north west northwest and then she's gonna quickly come back Lynn what should I do there's an archer what where oh that's Will hi you're one of Lynn's friends right um what what is it are you unwell I'm sorry Will her name is Florina she's timid around men and you've got a bow oh I see you must be a Pegasus Knight you cannot see she's a Pegasus Knight I don't know I apologize for frightening you but I do understand your fear of bows I um, I'm sorry. Even looking at a bow frightens me ever so much. Of course, I understand, but you should really only fear enemies, archers, not your own. Yes, of course. Yeah, Pegasus Knights, Pegasus Knights are super effective against bows. Visit. You came to help the village? That's good. With so many bandits, I wasn't sure what we'd do. It's not much, but please take this money. There's an armory to the southwest, east of us. Yeah, equip yourself as you see fit and help us, please. 200 gold? Yep, yep. Women, weapons have a limited number of attacks. Where do I want to put her? I can put her here, but... Ooh, that's not good. Oops, don't want to click that button. That's not so desirable. What level is Kent? It's two and two. I'm going... To, let's take Kent, bring him over here. Attack, like... Iron Lance. Actually, yeah, that'll get the kill. 
And then I can take Sane, put him in where the bandit archer's place is, and attack that other dude. Uh-huh. Let's get you here. And, ooh, this is not doubling. I'm guessing that's not either. But I am in the forest tile, so... Question, how is Kent able to double an archer, but an, a, a bandit, a more muscular guy with an axe, so a heavier weapon, can't... You know what? I'm not going to question it. There's probably some logic somewhere. I'm going to bring Will down here, and... Oh, there's a mountain there, so I can't really bring Lynn up there, but she can totally be down. Hit and miss, and hit and hit, yes! Almost a level up, or not really. Technically, isn't always almost a level up. This is not good. It only does 9 damage. Oh, but another 9, and I'm down. I need to heal up Florina, which is not good. E. Sane is also, well, at this part of the game, Sane will be fine to go through the rest of the level with his health, but I need to get into a habit of healing. Does Florina have a vulnerary? Yes, she does. Uh, come here. Take a vulnerary. Yeah, no point in really bothering to move Lin up anyways. Move her down there, and Will can actually attack the archer. Will isn't the best unit, but as long as I have him, I might as well use him, right? He's an... Ooh, critical hit. Success. Yes. Insane can get this kill. Iron Sword. This chapter is to clear out the bandits, right? It's not a, uh... Seize? I don't think so, because we're not... We're not claiming anything. We're clearing out the bandits. I can send you down there, and those guys will move. And let's just get Lin to the over here. Can you attack Lin from there? Yes, you can. I'm gonna stick you next to her. You can go over here, and he only does nine damage to Florina. So will this kill? Nine plus four, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. What if I'm on a wall? Let's put myself out here on the wall, and I think I will not die from this. But Florina needs experience, because she is gonna- Oh! Even a miss! That's even better. Now I'm gonna be attacked by him, and... Yeah. Oh, who, who's left? Oh, right. Kent. Let's come here. Armory. Uh, I can buy another sword. And I guess I'll buy another one of those, too. I don't really need them, but if I do, if, hits, and Florina will hit back. Florina's good because she can go to further spaces and take on bunches of enemies, because she's got high speed, so she can avoid a lot. Not so high defense, so i got to be careful in that area. Ooh, like that. But, like, she's got high speed, so I'm usually the one to double instead of the opponents with Florina, so, yeah, that's good. However, now once again, I need to pull her back, and I don't actually need to waste a vulnerary because, well, I'm not going to really need her for the rest of the level, but you can totally kill this person. Like that, yes, perfect. Ooh, 88 experience. The reason why I'm recording this now, by the way, uh, is because I do have play practice later, like, I need to leave in 22 minutes, still need to get ready, brush my teeth, put on clone, all that sort of stuff. But, I'm fine. You have 11 and 7. 11 plus 7 is 18, he will do 18 damage to Will. Minus 5. 18 minus 5 is 13. He will not kill Will with a one hit, so I might as well do this. I remember this! Yes, the first time I was playing through the game, I did this too, and I saw this, and it's like, draw your sword to an archer. That's so funny. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Draw your swords. We're not listening to any of your stinking apologies. 
But if he's talking to Florina, isn't she a spear user? I don't care. That's so funny. I actually did the same exact thing. Bring ya. Are you can able? To no, you cannot attack that force base. And in case I need to pull back anyone, probably won't. Ken should be able to get the kill with his iron sword. Oh, that's. Ooh. I can't actually do that. That will not benefit me. And insane. Will 100% get the kill. Yes. Sane is actually turns out to be the better unit in the longer run. Uh, in my actual playthrough, I, I didn't use Sane all the way through, but Sane is I did use him a lot longer than I used Kent. Cause he only got so many spaces to use characters. And yeah. Okay. Let me just move my stuff. Uh, you live to regret this, my brothers. The get the Ganelon bandits. Will not let this stand. Sorry. Level up strength, skill, luck, yes, yes, yes. And I win. That's finally taken care of. Lynn! Florina, why did you follow us? It's so dangerous. Do you remember the knighting ceremony of the Pegasus? Knights of Elia? Yes, you joined a band of freelance soldiers to further your training. Is this what brought you here, Florina? Uh-huh. I wanted to talk to you before I set out. But when I went to Sakai, I heard that you left with some strangers and... You were worried for me? Thank you, but I'm more worried about you. Me? Listen, most mercenaries people are men and... They're in a band or something. I can't imagine you being at all comfortable around them. I know, I know. It's just I've always dreamt about being a Pegasus Knight. I imagined I would just work it out somehow. After all, after today, I'm not so sure. Maybe I should just give up. Florina, don't cry. Yes, there's no reason to give up th their dream. Hmm? Lovely, for Florina. I have the most brilliant idea. Sane. You should come with us. With the addition of Will here, we're a fine group of soldiers, and a freelance to boot. Wait, did you just include me? Of course. We were destined to meet here. It's fate. Come now, Lindis's band of mercenaries is a good training group, as you will find anywhere. Saying this is no joking matter. Lindis, um, Lin? Mercenaries? I can give you details later. This is all a bit rushed. However, Sane is right. Will you come with us, Florina? Travel with you, Lynn. Truly. I would be so happy. So, so happy. Fantastic, beautitious Florina. I am a knight of Kaelin. My name is Sane. Eek! Stay back. Don't get so close. Ah, beautiful, and yet so modest. I beg your forgiveness, calling us mercenaries. No, I approve. We can't leave Florina on her own. Oops. She requires special attention, though. Can I count on you? Yes. You have but yet to ask. So, is it really alright if I travel with you? Oh yes, of course, if you're willing, Will. Actually, I'm very grateful. Truth be told, all of my money was stolen, and I'm at a bit of a crossroads. I would be honored if to count myself as one of Lind's legion. Lindus's legion. Lindus's legion? This is getting strange with every day for Eb. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'd like to thank you for watching this video. Uh, apologize for the misconvenience at about end of the chapter, but I hope you enjoyed it, and there will be more of this in the future, so see ya, bye!